At JSU's weekly press conference on Monday, quarterback Eli Jenkins admitted he needed to Google the Liberty Flames football stadium to get a sense of where the Gamecocks are headed this Saturday. He said what he saw was impressive. Images like this came up on his Google search, and it's not hard to see why he was impressed. The Flames have one of the largest budgets in the FCS, as well as the largest stadium and attendance numbers. Liberty plays in Lynchburg, Virginia, while JSU will get another playoff-like test. And as you can expect, they're excited about that challenge. You walk out and chills, chills down your body looking up and seeing the crowd and they're cheering as loud as they can. And that's one thing when you go to somebody else's crowd and everybody's cheering, you want them to be quiet. You want to do so good that you have that many thousands of people quiet. And they say the fans right behind you, you know, hearing those fans, you know, calling me the sorriest quarterback they ever seen in their life and, you know, talking trash. It's, it's going to be it's going to be great, you know, go out there on the field and prove them wrong. To learn that that was, you know, one of the best environments in the country, you know, I mean, it, it is huge, you know, and they, they put their students and their uh, band and stuff right behind you, and it's, you know, loud. And uh, But, you know, I, we've been in games like that before. That environment's going to be really good for us. And uh, like I said, I, we're, we're looking forward to the challenge because they got a great team, great program, you know, so it's, uh, we got to play well. JSU's obviously played in places like Death Valley at LSU, played at Auburn last year, Michigan State as well. So a tough test coming up this Saturday. The Gamecocks and Flames hook up Saturday night at 6 p.m. You can catch that game on ESPN3.